you know, I'm coming out to Little Vibe Friday, but I got this thing that I'm gonna be doing. So when I say Little Vibe, I want y'all to say Friday. Little Vibe Friday! Because the only thing I know is LA. So what part of the West Coast y'all from? Anybody? That's all I know too. Oh, Stop wow. it. Stop it. Stop Like stockings? Stockings? Shreveport is five miles from New Orleans, so I don't give a fuck. Okay, what about it? It's called Letterman. Uh, it's my song, so you can play it when you're ready. So let's get it. First song called Playground. Y'all rock with me, alright? I know y'all smoking here, so. <laughs> hey. Got a bad bitch leaning on my shoulder. We gon' take a trip. One hand puffing good weed, other on the whip. Shotty nails, dead toes, dead. She a whole team. Trust me, we know how to trap all the ladies. It's heavy for me. I never say sorry for fucking your peace. I'll make a call up a friend that ain't geek. She a call you when she leaves. Cause you got to sit her girl sick. I just dropped an amazing album called Can't Call It. I go by the real Marco so on Instagram. So y'all fuck with me. I will fuck with you. All right. Stay humble in this game. And uh, yeah, love life, man. Young, young. Y'all ain't fucking with me. I ain't tripping. No. I'm from New York City. Um, yeah. <laughs> Money my mind, post a stop, never a look behind her. She give me time, I give her one. That's the equation, that's fine. I meet you, I'm enough forever on fire. Desire, you like Mariano. I will pop a little sand, it's gonna get me higher. You in H Town, baby girl, H Town. You in H Town, baby girl, H Town. I was riding on the moonlight with Trail Will. I'm just letting y'all know, close that fucking front door. AC, the bill is fucking high. Y'all quiet? I'm just 
없는 내 결실은 내 정리까지 망가지 꿈들과 내가 챙겨야 모든 걸 갖고 올라갈 거야 탑까지 온다고 같이 믿고 절대로 포기 못해 나 지금 내 모든 걸 포치고 니들 맘속 대파가 푸는 내 이름 Thank you. My name is Juno. Yeah. Yeah. My Instagram is F E A T Happy Fit Happy. And after the open mic, I want to interview with yours. Or oh, I'm not rapper. I'm hip hop YouTuber. So thank you very much. <laughs> Eternally thinking, God, please don't let me be dead. But your once snow white gown is now stained bloody red. Look at my daughter. Isn't she beautiful? Isn't she enough proof that we were once in love, but divorce has taught me more than love ever could? I've learned three things. One. When I talk my shit, when I talk like this and sort of rhyme that hits with alliteration that pits my lips against my brain as I train my subconscious to be conscious. Updates when you turn on your PlayStation, lay down for a quick nap and you woke up in the AM, that thing in the fridge that somebody ate when you spent all day waiting and waiting, the one you've been dating you realize that you can't relate with and your heart has been aching. I am that nigga that looked like an op, but boy was mistaken. Now my whole family is shaking. So many shades on the spectrum of my blackness. So many different colors shapes, sizes. My people are so versatile, trend-setting, but in our shoes, no one would ever walk a mile. Everyone wants to be black till it's time to be treated black. Mm -hmm. And I wonder why. Why our culture is so sought after. I know we're the shit, but for so long, they thought we were bottom tier. Butts too big, lips too thick, music too aggressive for white ears, hair too distracting, unprofessional, nappy, whatever the hell they want to say to disguise their racism. But now they want the recipe to our secret special sauce. Yeah. So excuse me when I change my hair, my coworkers question and stare. Do anything to anybody. You have so much worth. Think about a treasure of, of gold. You have that treasure in your heart and it's just waiting to be manifested to this world because you have something powerful that you can give to the world around you if you haven't already. And I'm hearing some great talent tonight. And I believe that you can bring it to greater stages, greater places, because if you have that in your heart to bring it to greater stages, then I promise you that you will get to make it come to greater stages, greater places, greater relationships, and you will make the wiser decision moving forward from the lessons of your past. So thank you for listening to me. Hey, all the artists tonight, all y'all was awesome and y'all rocked out. Have a nice one, drive home safe. Fuck the police. Yeah. <laughs> What's up, what's up, people? My name is Jay Whipple. I'm here in Los Angeles, one of the greatest cities in the world, if I'm being honest. Oh, yeah. You from New York and why you came here? I'm actually born and raised in Brooklyn, but I've been living in Florida for like the past six, seven years. Um, I came out to LA to perform a bunch of music, and it seems like it's going good so far. Oh, uh, How did you rank today's open mic? I don't want to say it was a 10 out of 10, <laughs> man. I feel like that's a... <laughs> I feel like it was a 8 and a half out of 10. I wish there was more people. I wish there was more time that we could perform. I wish there was more people up there to perform. And <laughs> um, <laughs> Thank you. Hi, my name is Jania. My artist name is Carneliana, and this was my first time performing at open mic. Oh, first time? Yeah. Really? No, no way. You. Oh, West your side. voice is awesome. Thank yeah. you so much. I appreciate Yes, so you were cool too. I didn't know what you said, but I was in the back. Yeah, Hi. thank you. You're How did you write today's open mic? Uh, I love today's open mic. I come to this open mic every Friday. It's been a, been a while since I came because I've been busy, it, yeah. but yeah, it's always a vibe. Everybody's a family after a few times you come, and it's great. Oh, yeah. thank you very much. What's up with y'all? I'm Madam Mac, you know what I'm saying? From Chicago. That's M A D A W M A K. Yeah, that's who I am. 
Yeah, oh, uh, today's why you came here or Los Angeles? I'm from Chicago, but I'm, you know, always looking for better opportunity. And now I'm here in California. It'll take a bulldozer to get me up out oh. this motherfucking gift. <laughs> and, uh, I just love music. I love everything about it, just creating it, doing it, and being around other people that actually love the art and do it just for the art. So I definitely want to come out and check everybody out today. Oh, your music is crazy. Hey, Good. yours is yeah. crazy too. You had the crap, <laughs> but you. I don't know. You was yeah, I'm we not a leper. To... Oh, how did you write today? open mic everybody supported each other a lot of people stayed to the end and like I said I just love being in the space with artists no matter what you do if you YouTube if you are passionate about that if you do music if you do poetry whatever you do if you authentic with it you know what I'm saying if you're really authentic no matter what it is I'm here to support that no matter what culture no matter what type of person so I just want to support everybody you know Okay, thank Let's you show. very much. Let's yeah, show. I'm glad to meet you. Yes. Yeah. Hi, my name is Jesse and I'm a spoken word poet. Yeah, and uh, can you say about we already met uh, Soulful Noise and uh, New York Open Mic? Yes. Yeah. So we met Open Mics in New York and in an open mic called Soulful Noise. There was a lot of music, a lot of jazz bands, a lot of really good culture. This wonderful YouTuber come. I was um, dealing with a few difficult situations in my life at the time and I needed a way to express myself to kind of just let it out, you know, and the poem really helped me get that out make me feel less alone because when I would perform it it just <laughs> makes you. great connections with artists and continues to build community you yeah. know in the artist space and <laughs> oh thank you very much yep. this is my story <laughs> and keep oh. it for you two artists my documentary and this logo is me and it's okay. me <laughs> I love that thank you <laughs> thank you well, I'm ZNG. I'm from New York City. Just um, out here in Cali for a few days. Nine yeah, Harlem. You from Harlem? Yeah. yeah I'm from home. Yeah. yeah Why you came to uh, Los Angeles? California? Well, I came to Los Angeles for the, yeah. a weekend, just like a cool weekend experience, and I figured out it was a mic, an open mic, and I was like, let me pull up. You know, oh. I'm trying to grow my audience and trying to see like yeah. where I'm at. Your lift? Yeah. 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 So, <laughs> sorry. Sorry. It says he's about to leave. Oh yeah. Yeah. Okay. <laughs>